electric current uh, what is electric current electric current symbol is i electric current is rate of flow of charge rate of flow of charge that is i symbol for electric current is i and q is flow of charge divided by time this is called rate of flow of charge now unit of charge is coulomb and uh, unit of time is second unit of current is called ampere that is spelling a m p e r u ampere and uh, c o u l u m -E, coulomb and second you know what is the si unit that is a uh, SI unit of electric current. SI unit of electric current is what? Ampere. Suppose one coulomb of charge flows in one second. Suppose this is a conductor, a metallic conductor. This is the area of cross section. In one second, one coulomb of charge. See one coulomb of charge. See one coulomb of charge flows in one second comes out then how much current is flowing in the conductor one ampere of the current therefore how to define one ampere you can define when one coulomb when one coulomb of charge flows through the through any conductor through a conductor in one second then the current passing through that conductor is 1 ampere. Therefore, they may ask you, for one mark they will ask you, what is 1 ampere, what is electric current, this is the definition. And SI unit of current is called ampere. And define define one ampere. This is one mark. They may ask you. Therefore, uh, here every line is important. Now, what is a basic uh, charge? Q Q represents charge. Is it not electric charge? basic charge now basic charge this one coulomb see electron one electron electronic charge is called a basic charge what is the unit of one electronic charge 1.6 into 10 to the power of minus 19 coulomb it is only one charge on one electron how many electrons form one coulomb uh, you have seen the lardo no lardo is made up of lot of bundis a lot of units is it not like a it is one unit, right? This is one coulomb. But it contains so many electrons. How many electrons? How many electrons form? How many electrons form one coulomb? The method is very simple. Suppose n electrons is equal to one coulomb. Then number of electrons is equal to one coulomb divided by E. But you know this E value normally they give in the exam this value or you can remember this 1.6 this is 19 if 19 jumps it becomes 16 this negative becomes point it goes inside like that you can remember 19 it jumps from there 19 it's in you know, 16 it becomes right put this point here easy to remember therefore 1 coulomb divided by um, electronic charges about 1.6 into 10 to the power of minus 19 coulomb 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 get cancelled therefore number of electrons is equal to 1 by 1.6 into 10 to the power of minus 19 you take to the numerator 
10 to the power of 19 by 1.6. See, remember this. If I take any number to the numerator, minus n. For example, a, a to the power of 5, minus a to the power of 5. If a to the power of minus 5, if it is there, sign changes. Here, plus it becomes minus. Plus becomes minus. Minus becomes plus. Same way here also, right? Now, 10 to the power of 19. Now, 10 to the power of, say, 19 can be written as 10 into 10 to the power of 18 or 100 into 10 to the power of 17 or 1000 into 10 to the power of 16. You can write, as you release one on zeros, the power keep decreasing. Therefore, what I do is, I release one zero, 10 into 10 to the power of 18 divided by 1.6. Then I calculate 1.6. Just I calculate number of electrons is 6.25. After calculation, if you use the calculator, I remember the value just I am writing it. Uh, just uh, I recently I have calculated, therefore I remember this value. If you calculate using calculator 6.25 into 10 to the power of 18 electrons. Even if it is wrong, just understand the concept. Okay. Just press 10 divided by 1.6 in the calculator, you will get 6.25, I hope. Okay. Therefore, therefore, 6.25 into 10 to the power of 18 the electrons constitute, constitutes 1 coulomb. Uh, like, uh, how, how many marks they may ask you? They may ask you for 2 marks. They may change the problem in this one. How many electrons? forms 1 micro coulomb or how many electrons form 1 milli coulomb what do you mean by micro micro is 10 to the power of minus 6 coulomb milli is 10 to the power of minus 3 coulomb right if they ask micro if they ask micro micro is 10 to the power of minus 6 therefore subtract this how much you will get 6.25 into 10 to the power of 18 minus 6 how much 12 so many electron forms 1 micro coulomb milli coulomb just use milli coulomb means milli is 10 to the power of minus 3 just subtract 3 therefore 6.25 into 10 to the power of 15 electron forms 1 coulomb likewise many competitive exams for neat uh, all India entrance exam, engineering and medical entrance exams, railways exam, even bank exam they will ask. These are the basic cons what are the concepts. This is about um, elementary level, uh, about within 10 standard they may ask you, right? And if there is any mistake or any, what is that, you can always send through the message and uh, try to propagate this knowledge for deprived student, okay? Thank you.